Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. I am Key. And if you are new here, welcome to my channel. If you like what I do, I'd appreciate it if you could comment, subscribe, share. And once you do, hit that little bell notification right on the right hand side of your screen so that you can be updated every day that I upload a new video. And if you are not new here, welcome back family. I hope you guys are having a great day. I know I am. Or at least I'm trying to anyway. I went and got my nails done, especially for this video for you guys. Wait, let me see. Oh, ah, rose gold, pink. <laughs> so the reason that we are here is because I finally got one of my packages from Wish. I've been saying this to you guys for probably like a month and a half now, maybe two months. I'm not even sure anymore. I don't even freaking remember what I ordered. I'm almost positive I did two rings, a bracelet, and a necklace for a, a jewelry review haul. But Wish has been playing games with me and part of me feels like it's because we're coming off of the holiday season and we're rolling into tax season. And so that's what I'm going with here. So I got the first ring today and I'm going to review it today because I don't want to have to wait another month and a half for the stuff to come and then I don't have any wish videos out. I love doing wish videos so we're going to do this thing today. So let's jump into this. This is not of course you guys if you've been watching me from the beginning this is not what it comes in so don't get all hype or happy like oh wish is stepping their game up. They're not. It came in a little baggie inside of a um bubble wrapped envelope to protect it i transferred the ring into this box <laughs> because i just think presentation wise is better this way so let's jump into this plus i like this i like being able to do this for you guys and then boom the shimmer the shine the sparkle the fire i enjoy doing that so <laughs> that is why i stick it in these boxes don't get all happy and be like oh wish is stepping up they ain't Trust me, if they were, I'd have let you guys know it. Plus, on top of that, I wouldn't know because I'm just getting my stuff. Anyway, <laughs> this is a wedding set. I don't know how I managed to mess up because I did. This is a size 6 and I'm not going nowhere with this ring other than right here with you guys. Boom. That's where I'm going with it to try it on for you guys. That's it. That's all I got. Let me back this up just a little bit so you can see. So this ring is sterling silver. It is real. Oh, my hands are so cold. Um, this is a sterling silver ring. It is um, real sterling silver. I checked it out. The um, 925 or the 952 is inside of the ring. I always get the numbers mixed up. I don't know if you guys can see the engraving right there. But this is real sterling silver. And of course the stones are CZs. I paid a dollar for this ring and then two dollars for shipping. So in total three bucks, which isn't bad. Um I went to go look back for a link for you guys, but the ring is sold out. Um, and I don't know how Wish usually works when things sell out. I don't know if they usually get them back or um so I'm not even gonna put the link in the description because I'm just not sure. And I mean, they were sold out in every size. So I'm not even going to set you guys up and send you on no crazy goose chase for this ring because it is gone. But I could see why it would be gone considering that it was only a buck. So, oh, I need to clean underneath my nails, huh? Um, the center stone is a CZ, all the little small stones on the side are of course CZs. And just like any jewelry, um, you wanna make sure that you take it off when you have product on your hands, when you're doing your hair or your makeup. Come here, little ring. Uh, you wanna make sure that you're taking all the products, um, making sure that your hands are clean when you're dealing with these. And when you clean them, I typically, I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen them on YouTube where you take a little bit of Dawn soap and some hot water and you let it soak for a little while and you take a fine bristle toothbrush, preferably a baby toothbrush, and um, you just gently scrub it. Nothing too serious, not too, don't get all wild on it. You know, just a gentle scrub because if you scrub too hard or if you use the wrong toothbrush, you are going to loosen up the little small prongs. I don't know if you can see them. 
camera not focusing for you guys um you're going to loosen that up and you're going to more than likely end up losing stones a lot quicker and that's for any jewelry not just sterling silver you want to make sure that you're doing that with any jewelry your gold your platinum um your silver your copper whatever any whatever your whatever your material is you want to gently brush it don't get all crazy and get obsessive it doesn't need all of that um what made me pick this ring i don't know maybe they sold out of nines and i just didn't notice it in a rush trying to check out i'll lay that right there i normally i i, I wear fake rings as i wait for my upgrade for my wedding ring and my engagement ring i'm getting an upgrade for both and that's another that's a story time conversation that i keep saying i'm going to have with you guys and then i never do um so that I'm not always ringless. <laughs> I do have a couple of fake rings or not. Well, sterling silver rings that I switch out periodically because I don't like going outside without any ring on my hand. Um, These are good for that. If you got to go to work, if you got to go on vacation, if you have to... um do anything that would require hard labor or the fear of your actual wedding set being stolen because i know a lot of people have that fear we you know our men pay a lot of money all girls they pay a lot of money for our jewelry for these engagement rings and these wedding rings and the last thing you want is for someone to take it so it's good to have decoys like this so that if anything ever were to happen you know that your 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 precious gem is in the house safe while you're on vacation or at the beach or doing whatever it is that you do or at work you know that it's safe at home and i think that's what's really good about these and they're inexpensive so even if you want to do um something like this sterling silver and want to do a set and use that as a starter ring rings are expensive nowadays and um a lot of women, you know, prefer to have a house and a car and be more set. So you can always do something like this as a starter ring. And then maybe by the time you guys get married, you can upgrade it. Or once you've been married for a while, you can upgrade it. That's what's going on with us right now. I've been married for almost six years and finally getting an upgrade to my ring. And I'm cool with that because it's the ring of my dreams. I actually took some time and got to understand the jewelry part of things. And, um... That is my end-all, be-all ring. It's kind of like a forever home, but on my finger. <laughs> so, with all of that being said, I want to tell you guys, if you can just see, I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm looking at the camera, and I'm looking at it in real life, too. And I just feel like you guys are just not seeing the sparkle that I can see in real life. It is so pretty. The fire in this ring is beautiful and the one thing about which that I can genuinely appreciate is that my rings are always really good I haven't had one bad ring yet but I don't want to speak too soon because I have more stuff coming and that'd be my luck um I am giving this away my original plan was to keep it because I wanted to try something different as far as style um my rings that I switch out here and there they typically they, they are pretty much the same just maybe a different um plating over top of it as far as color but they're they're usually about the same so i wanted to try something different but clearly i am not doing that this go round. so i'm gonna take it back to the to the good old days in my first video if you want this ring comment down below that you want it and i will randomly select someone and once i do i'll contact you get your information and i will mail this off to you guys um because i i don't i can't do anything with it I was going to keep it, but I can't. So I might as well give it away to one of my one of my K squad ladies. Um, and you guys can do with it what you please. Wear it. And someone said to me, try to order different sizes. I did not do this intentionally, but I, this is a size six. So there you go. <laughs> I normally get my ring size because sometimes I give them away or I say I'm going to and then I change my mind. And then they just like stay in my jewelry box as pretty little trinkets. But this cannot stay because this does not fit anything. I can't even, you know, like that's just a little too much for me. 
Yeah, no. So, yes. Comment down below. And depending on how long this is up, please read the description for me, y'all. Because the first time I did this, I mean, months after I had, like, sent the ring off, people were like, oh, I want it, I want it, I want it. And it got to the point where I had to turn, like, the comments off because I was constantly like, oh, I'm so sorry. I already given the ring away, da, 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 da. I will put in the description, I did it in that video, but I just say this for warning. Please read the description. Um, as soon as I pick someone and I get it mailed off, I will put in the description that this ring is no longer available so that I'm not like getting anybody's hopes up thinking that they're going to get a ring because I've already sent this to someone else. You guys give me one second. I've already sent this to someone else. And so... Um, just read the description to make sure that it's still available. If I haven't put anything in the description, it's because the ring is still available. And that's it. I love this. Y'all like this? I love this. I might have to try to, I don't know. I don't know. Wish messing me up They when they sold out of everything. So, like I said, comment down below if you want it. It is a size 6. And so, keep that in mind so that you're not coming to me later like, you think you can get it in a different size? No, this is the ring. This is what you get. That's all I got for you. <laughs> so, oh, that's so pretty. I will make sure I clean it up because I have cocoa, um, I have coconut oil in my hand. So, I'm pretty sure that I am going against my own rules of making sure you don't have product. But my hands are ashy and I could not get on here with ashy hands. So that is going to be all for this video, you guys. Did y'all see that shine? Yes, shine. That is going to be all for this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And like I said at the beginning, please comment, subscribe, become a part of my family, get the word out there. I am trying to get to 200 before the end of this month. So if you guys could help me out with that, that would be amazing. I have more jewelry review videos coming up. I am thinking about doing something from eBay. And I am also thinking about trying to find replica rings and then reviewing them. So I'm, I'm working on some stuff for the jewelry part of it. So hopefully you guys like this and you'll like what I have coming up. And I love you guys. Go be great. Bye.